Hey, this is Sean from the product team here at Soundcraft. You're watching our how-to video series for SI consoles. The multi-track recording you're hearing right now is being delivered from an option card we're really excited about, the Soundcraft Multi-Digital Card. The Multi-Digital Card offers 32 channels of playback and recording, either through the FireWire or USB ports on the rear. The card also has 8-at in and out ports located on the card providing an additional 8-in and 8-out 8-at interface for a total of 40 inputs and 40 outputs from the card. The primary purpose of this card is to record direct outputs of the input signals to a Mac or PC. If I record these multi-tracks raw, I can then mix them later in my home studio, providing a nice live demo. With this card, an SI Expression becomes a great front-end mixer for any studio, giving mic preamps for the inputs and distributing monitor mixes for all the musicians with Dynamics and EQ processing, whilst recording the channels raw and unprocessed. So let's start from the beginning. Let's install the card into the console. First, you need to make sure your console is off. Hot plugging, as it's called, will damage the option card and the console. So make sure you power off the console before swapping any option cards. Locate the card on the guide rails and firmly push the card in. Finger tighten the screws to keep the card in place and then switch the switch to your desired medium, FireWire or USB. Now, connect your console to your Mac through FireWire or PC using FireWire or USB and turn the console on and then your Mac or PC. When everything is booted, you've got to check a few things. Firstly, on your DAW, check the default audio driver. Where this is located and what title it is under depends on your DAW. On Pro Tools, as we are using, we have to look under Playback Devices and make sure that it is set to Soundcraft Digital 0000 audio driver. Now, create 32 channels in the DAW, receiving inputs 1 to 32, and set them to Record Enable. Now on the console, we want to patch 32 direct outputs. These outputs will send the input channels to the DAW pre or post high pass filter. To do this, select a channel, tap Inputs on the touchscreen, and scroll down to Direct Out Patch. Here you will see the possible direct output patches. Scroll to Multi Digital Output 1 and tap that output to connect the patch. Use Autocomplete to patch 8 channels at a time. Rinse and repeat until you reach 32 inputs, and now you're sending your inputs through the gain control and then onto your DAW for multi track recording. If you've recorded the gig and are now at home and ready to mix the show, set the DAW outputs to 1 to 32 and go onto the input menu, down to the input patch and patch the input channels to receive the multi-digital card outputs. Patch the left-right master to send to the DAW for a print-to-tape style mixing. Thanks for watching this edition of SI Series How-To Videos. Subscribe to our YouTube channel or check back for more updates. Until next time.